What's up, everybody? What's up? What's up? Y'all, y'all see this girl in front of you. Y'all probably know where you've seen her around somewhere. Well, this girl did a video called Response to Racist White Bitches. Fail. And it was funny as hell the first time I saw it, man. I said, damn, that was funny as shit. I, like, one thing is, I give her a mad prom because she was talking to shit. Now, I didn't, like, I noticed the picture right behind you. You probably see it in this picture, but her picture is in the background. You kind of notice it, but you didn't know it was going to fall on her, but you noticed the picture. But she tries to talk shit about some white girls making fun of Mexicans. Like, I have no, I have no problem with Mexicans. I love Mexican women, and I'm like, Olele, olele, vato chingala. But, uh, and she talking all this shit, man. I give her props for showing off the girl's phone numbers. All this shit. But did not know her picture was going to fall on her head. I was tripping my ass. I said, I give you kudos for the shit talking a little bit. Just kudos. Kudos. But damn, that picture frame falling on your head. That was some funny ass shit. Hey, look. Never put a big picture on your desk where you can fall on your head. If I was you, hang it up on the wall. So it won't fall on me. Not to be mean, but that's how it is. Hang it on the wall, not on your desk. That was fucked up, man. But then, one thing is I couldn't understand why she edited that part out. She could have bullshit that. She could have bullshit that. She could have sat there and talked all the shit she wanted in the video she did. But, that picture, for, she should have, like I said, she should have edited out that, uh, that picture falling on her fucking head. That was just kind of funny as shit. Even if you high, you thought this video was funny. Because it is funny. Because what that gets, man, you never, like, because I've seen a lot of guys doing nut shots and all this. I didn't find this out about this girl video until I was watching Tag the Show the other day. And I was just laughing my ass off. I thought I had to find I said, man, this is funny as shit. I want to know who this girl is. That's one thing. I want to know who she is and how does she feel. How did she feel when she had that picture falling on her fucking head? And how did she feel now that the video has been seen by everybody? Even the part that where she where the shit fell on her head. I'm just saying, I feel bad. I feel very bad. I feel... <laughs> now, I kind of do feel bad for this girl. Because this girl tried to talk all this shit. And the damn picture fell on the damn head. Put you fell on her head now. I just, oh man, for real though. Why do like I tell it's it's like this. You set yourself up for failure. Like I'm gonna play some of this shit what she talked about because the girl must have loved setting herself up. Nah. Yeah, yeah, See, that's the girl. I want to know who this girl is. I want to know everything. Like, I really want to just go on blog TV and open up my show so I can interview this girl. Like, how the fuck did she feel when that damn picture landed on her head? Like, why didn't, why didn't you just set the picture down on the floor, put it up on the wall, let it on your bed, put it somewhere where it wouldn't fall on your fucking head? And... And I give you, I give you, I, it's like it, it is an epic fail. It is an epic fail. But I do give props that she did try her best trying to shit talk over the internet. See what happens when you shit talk somebody, bad things will happen to you. And this was kind of fucked up. I'm telling you, this was fucked up, man. This was on her. This was going to fall on her. Now, 
Mate, like, look, if you want tips on how to shit talk in a video, I'll give you tips. You start off right by calling them bitches, but you should have took it a little bit farther. Look here, motherfucker, bitch, motherfucker. You try to talk shit about Mexican or start speaking Spanish or, or call them pichi cabrón, pichi I speak Spanish, but I'm not Mexican. Just start speaking in Spanish. Uh, pichi, uh, pichi cabrón, pichi punta punta, chupa de huevos, uh, all that shit. Then speak in English, like, bitch, I can speak it. Don't be a. F but damn, just for this girl. <laughs> 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 oh. I thought, man. I don't want to think about it, it's too damn funny. But I will put the link to the video in the description box. But like I said, I would love to know who this girl is. Yeah, I would love to know who this girl is. Not in time, oh, he wants to rank this girl. No. It's just, I want to know who this girl is. So, if I could, because one thing is, I wanted to get in contact with me so I could have a, do a show on Blog TV and interview her about this damn video. Because it's funny as hell. It's funny. I bet people around the world has laughed at this girl. I bet they even got Latinos laughing at her ass. I said, hey. Hey, I said, look at this. Look at this mamacita. Oh, la, She got the painter. She had the picture falling on her head. Laughing her ass off because I, I don't know. How you going to represent for Latinos, Mexicans, or... How you going or, or Hispanics? And you let a picture fall on your fucking head. <laughs> God. For real. Don't rep don't, look, the girl don't need to represent no race. For real, she cut off. She cut off. Just because that whole video was just funny. She can shit talk, but never again she should be representing a certain race. Because that was so silly just for her to out of all the people, I thought white folks were crazy we were doing the whole nut shots or jumping off big ass houses, big ass buildings and doing all that shit. But damn, it tastes the cake. It really does taste the cake. Like, I'm not trying to talk shit about Latinos or whites. It's just this girl representing the Latino and Hispanic and Mexican race. And she made slabs of herself by letting the picture fall on her fucking head. Now that's good. Y'all, you probably gonna sit there and say, man, why you keep repeating yourself? Because it's funny. Once your comedian on TV and he will start repeating certain words, then you can say something. But you got to agree with me. That was just so damn funny, man. If Richard Pryor was still alive today and saw this video, he'd be laughing his ass off. He'd be like, this is some funny shit. That's the way I say, this is some funny shit. Bernie Mac Bob said, man, this is some funny shit. Funny as hell, but like, oh, no, Jesus. I was, girl, let me tell you. I would love for you to do a video response to this video. If you do, if you do, I will sit there and <laughs> probably back you up on some of your shit. But, damn. But, that's how it is, girl. You need to, uh, well, you just need to take your time in here and, and take, kiss your boo-boos and shit and all like that, but for, for a while, your, your shit talking, these, your shit talking card is revoked. Shit talking card revoked. Well, this has been Afro, for real, her shit card has been revoked. Everybody got a shit card. I got one. Mine is just too, mine is big with Wookiees on it. But it's like this. Yeah, this has been Afro Joe. If you like what you see, tell me what you think in a comment or a video response. If you don't like what I have got to say, you can kiss my ass and burn the hand take your ass home somewhere because I don't want to hear your bullshit. But check me out. Follow me on Twitter at Twitter at Afro Joe the Wookie. And check out my merchandise at Zazzle.com slash the Wookie. Holly if you hear me. Uh, Nah, 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 nah.
Nanan. Nanan.